Today we are talking about chili farming in yes. Uganda mm. and of course I'm here with Arthur who is a chili farmer. He's actually a very experienced farmer. He's doing chili, he's doing pineapple, he's doing goats farming and others and he's doing them in large numbers. So if you are interested in any of this, this is actually a right video for you. My name is Layo Charles and this is the Ugandan farmer. We bring to you stories of Ugandan who are into farming and agriculture. So today we want to talk chili farming in Uganda. Okay. And I have a question to ask. You know, today will be like a random question because mm. a lot of people are always searching about chili farming. There are certain things they want to know. And my first question is, how long does chili take to grow in the garden? Uh, thank you so much. That's a very good question. Um, just like I always advise farmers, if you're going to go into chili farming, mm. it starts by setting up the nursery bed. Yeah. Now, if you're in the northern part of Uganda, I would encourage that you set up the nursery bed because remember, this is going to be rain fed. Now, since we normally begin uh, the rains at around, getting rains at around uh, mid-March, I would encourage that in Feb or mid Feb, yeah. establish a nursery bed. Uh, the, the, the seeds will last there at least one month. Now, from there, they'll be ready to be transplanted. Then you take them maybe mid March, you put them in, your, in a place where you've designated for growing your chilies. Mm -hmm. uh, from there, uh, it will take uh, one and a half to two months uh, to be on the safer side. Let's call it two months. But they'll even start flowering at one and a half. So, Right from establishing the nursery bed to your first uh, product, it will take you three months. One in the nursery bed and two months in in the garden. And then you'll be able to start harvesting chili. Yeah. Yes. 